Hey guys, so here's my little man. He's looking so cute today. Um, he's wearing the same jeans he wore yesterday because I don't have a whole lot of pants for him. And this goes with this shirt really well. And he just looks so handsome, doesn't he? He styled his hair. So, it's like got that kind of swirl right there. And it looks really cute that way. It looks cute in a mohawk too, but with this outfit, it looks cute this way. And then I have him in his striped orange onesie. It's sort of like a polo-ish type thing without the, you know, cuffs. And then, um, or I mean the collar. And then he's got his, obviously his, um, his jeans, Beta Glory jeans. And then he's got these shoes, which are really big because they were Evans. And they, you know, Evans a bigger boy. Well, was a bigger boy, and um, they're obviously really big, but they're still cute. So, usually, if you put shoes on a baby this small, they're always big, and he has really small feet. So, they look okay, though, I think, because you know, they're always gonna look big when they're this small. Um, so yeah, he looks really handsome. Let's say hi, ladies. <laughs> He's so cute. So, I'm gonna go ahead and feed him. I'm going to put his bib on. I got this bib from his Aunt Shanine a while ago for um, a different boy I had. So I'm going to go ahead and put you guys right, right there. There. Never mind, I could probably do this with one hand. Alright, you guys. There we go. Oh. Alright. And it's like double sided. I can use that side too, but I'm just using this side because the cow. It's really cute. <laughs> Alright, so let's see if I can position him to where it'll look okay. Alright, so I'm going to feed him out of the ducky bottle that I got from Melissa. So awesome. Okay, <laughs> so. Yeah. They were so cute. My little man. I did put baby powder on him today because um he was he's really he was was he's not now, but he was really 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 shiny, and I can't get to the store right now to buy magic erasers, so um I just had to. Use the baby powder, and it worked okay. I am going to go buy some magic erasers and just lightly run it over him because he's still kind of shiny. Um, but yeah, I also want to buy um, like some baby lotion because I I heard and I I've asked an artist, um, well Heather, if you can use lotion, and she said yeah as long as they're sealed right. And I haven't had paint rub off of either of my babies. So I'm pretty sure it's okay. So I'm going to go ahead and try that. So I'm going to go ahead and buy lotion sometime soon. Um, I'm figuring with the magic erasers and the lotion all it cost me about five bucks. So I'm trying to conserve some money right now. The money that I do have because um, most of it goes towards my toddler. And then the other half of it this week is going towards school. So I don't really have much money right now. So I'm just trying to kind of not buy anything. But that's not a big deal. It's only five bucks. So. so he's really, really cute. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and burp him now. His head's been getting, like, really loose, and it's freaking me out. I'm afraid it's going to come off. But I don't know what else to do. If it comes off, it comes off, because I don't have my zip ties right now, and it takes forever to get it back on, so I'm just going to have to wait if it comes off. Poor little guy won't be around for Christmas. Well, he will, but he's going to be baby Jesus in the manger under our tree. So, Well, actually, we're probably not going to put it under the tree. We'll probably put it on something this year because of my dog. So, I don't know. Last year, she didn't mess with, with my 
nod that we had as baby Jesus, but I'm just afraid that she will. So, because she's gotten more curious, she's come up to them and, like, sniffed them, and I'm just afraid she's going to chew one up, so. So, you know, I can't believe her. She's a dog, you know, but still, I'm still freaked, so, yeah. I'm going to go ahead and take his bib off now. He is so cute, isn't he? Ah, he's so cute. He should feel special because mommy's never bonded with a boy like I have with him. Ever. So. Yeah, he's really cute. Um, I think the reason I bond with him so well as a boy is because he's still, um, like my first reborn because she was the Sam kit. The only difference between her and him was that her mouth is opened and... She had the same uh, limbs, exact same limbs, but she wasn't full-legged. So that's the only difference between them, and she had painted hair, but I mean, as far as um, the kit goes, it's pretty much the same as that kit. The mouth is just closed, so. Yeah, even right here kind of looks the same. Well, I mean, it looks, yeah, it does. It looks exactly the same. Everything looks exactly the same besides this lip right here. And I think the lip is what makes me think he looks like a boy, honestly. Because with the mouth open, I think it looks like a girl. But with the mouth closed, it looks more like a boy to me. I don't know. It's kind of a neutral kit, but I just like it better as a boy. I think it's his hair, too, that contributes. The way it's uh, rooted and styled, it looks like a boy. So, Yep, that's Mr. Uh, Isaiah, or Elijah. I always want to say Isaiah, but his name's Elijah. <laughs> Sorry, I have to get used to that, so, yeah. I had to kiss that little nose, but I'm going to go because this video is already seven minutes long, and I will talk to you guys soon. Oh, about my story. Um, I um, know I haven't done one in a couple days. I'm going to try and do one today or tomorrow, but I've tried a couple times, and it just will not op or upload episode 11, so I'm going to try different music and see if that's what it is. So, yeah. But I just want to let you guys know, because I know a lot of you have been reading my story and you say you're, like, addicted to it, so. <laughs> but thanks, that's a compliment, so. Alright, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye!